Hello, welcome to Share Sales Manual Transaction Demonstration. Today we're going to go over how to make a manual transaction for one of your affiliates. Making a manual transaction comes in handy in several situations, such as maybe you accidentally voided a transaction or you'd like to award the affiliate a one-time bonus for their work for your program. To make a manual transaction, go to Affiliates, Manual Transaction, Here you'll see you'll be able to choose the affiliate that you would like the manual transaction to be awarded to. You will also be able to choose if it's a percentage of sale or a flat amount. Flat amount would probably be helpful if you accidentally voided several transactions and that you want to sum all those transactions up as one lump sum. Percentage of sale is mostly useful if it's just that one sale that you're trying to recreate and you also want the affiliate to know that it was based off of a specific sale amount. You can also uh, select whether you would like the transaction to be as considered as a sale or lead or as a bonus manual credit. The difference between the two isn't necessarily really for merchants, but really helpful for their affiliates as affiliates will know that it's the recreation of a sale or lead um, or if they're being awarded a bonus or not. Um, bonuses are always good news. You'll also be required to comment uh, on the nature of the manual transaction. So in case that you accidentally avoided a sale, let the affiliate know about that or if it's a bonus, let them know that they earned a bonus. If you're recreating a sale, you also want to include your order number just so that the affiliate knows on their end that there it was based off of an order that may have just been accidentally voided. You'll also be able to select the lock date for the affiliate's transaction. The lock date is the date that merchants have to edit or void transactions, and it's also the day of payment for affiliates. So if you want your affiliate to receive their payment as soon as possible, choose the first lock date. If you still need time to consider the nature of the transaction, choose the latter. And when you're finished, submit the transaction.